How many times can I do an audio test and still feel like the best Minecraft MC that's me? But how's everybody doing today? I'm Jake from the internet, if you don't already know. And today, we are here in Minecraft 1.9, pre-release 2. Just hanging out in the Jake's World Let's Play single player world. Today, we're going to be doing some interesting stuff. Like, uh, cleaning up these trees. <laughs> to be talking about the 1.9 pre-release three boats anyway I don't know if they'll be the same when the actual full version comes out but here they are and I uh, hope you enjoy what is the sheep doing you go sheep Row that boat. Row that boat. So I just wanted to show everybody. The have changed boats. My game is so it's not reversed anymore. It's not like left paddle makes you go right and right paddle makes you go left anymore it's just left and right steering and uh, W is like gas like forward S is reverse it's just slow but you can still turn left and right and it's just like you know regular steering see how like late I can take this turn well you can yeah you can take turns like really late I'm just holding down gas holding down W cruise through here See if we can still pick up a squid. Did we get one? Nope. Oops. Back it up. I'm like right on top of one. I can't pick up a squid. Maybe they took that feature out. You can't pick up things in your boat anymore. But this is going to be awesome for like boat racing mini games and stuff. Yeah, buddy. Get your boat skills up. People have been waiting for this. Yeah, so this will this river will take us all the way over to like the the dwarves of the of the mountains area. And then the the people it'll take us to you know, here's like the plains land. And then over here, it'll take us to, like, the people of the forest who have yet to be named. Over here is the roofed biome. Past the giant spruce forest. Full of a bounty of resources. Yes, over here, past the skeletal horse that swims, is the, and just beyond this little edge of spruce biome you can see the mushroom in there there's a roofed biome and I was thinking of like maybe like uh, like that's like a magical forest it's an enchanted part of, it's like part of this forest but it's like the enchanted part I really uh, would love to build an enchanted forest seeing a couple things like what uh, they're doing on um, uh, Jason the nicest was doing on excuse me zombies was doing on the the uh, the freaking name the name of that series is uh, 
Something of wolves. It's not brothers. Uh, something of wolves. Something of wolves. Ha. Ha ha. I don't know. That'd be cool for a mini game. Have like a bunch of sheep or like animals in the water as obstacles. It's a little more random. It's not the same every time. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So now like we're over here. So if we're doing a project over here, instead of running on land and wasting hunger, we just boat. It saves food. It's the, it's the eco way of traveling. Finding myself using this mode of transportation more and more. It's not safe on land. All sorts of holes and things that you can fall into. Society of Wolves, that's what it's called. It took me a while, but I knew it. I wasn't going to look it up. Don't you think I was going to look it up? Something else that's kind of cool with the boats. I don't know if this was uh, the same in the old boats or if they just recently changed this, but when you get out, you go out the front, so if you park it just right, you don't land in the water. You can pick items up in one deep water with a, inside of the boat, so you can do a mini game like collecting items for points something like that with command blocks okay so figure something else out you don't disembark just towards the front you disembark whichever direction you're looking so if you have something like this you can uh, you, know, you bring your boat in and then you want to go into a corner, but you want to turn your boat like this so that when you leave, so that when you leave, you don't have to turn around. You can just get in and go, you know? I'm trying to think of like ways to make an automated like boat uh, flipping system to where you just pull in straight and get out and it flips the boat around for you. But I don't know what else like will interact with the boats. But you do something like that, and then you can get out by looking the direction you want to get like get out. Cool, right? Okay, so doing a test here. Can we push boats with sticky pistons? Or just regular pistons rather. We can. But I'm not sure why it's doing that. Yep, it wants to flow back to where it was before. It doesn't go all the way back. But it gets pretty close every time. Or slightly further away, I guess. Um, I'm not sure how they react with sticky pistons. If they do, I don't have any slimes to test it. But you can push them... Can you still drive them on land? Yes, you can still drive them on land. Just very slowly, the friction has been increased. So maybe it was intentional that they had that, uh, that you can move them on land before. They just didn't have the friction high enough. Because they seem to have kept it in this pre-release. So it could not be there in the full version. 
but you can't go up a block, so you have to start somewhere high up. Okay, we're just gonna test how it handles going downhill. Still got high friction. Oh. But it seems to have less, less friction when it's like hitting the corners. So maybe if there was like no flat spots. Twenty six blocks in the air. We already know it won't break if you smash into stuff going full speed. What about if you fall? Woo! Invincible. That was 25 blocks in the air, so I should have died. But the boat saved my life. Heading over to the swamp biome via this very convenient river that goes around like everything. Oh, 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 narrow, narrow spot. Crash. Where's the swamp? Up here. Oh, we actually can't get in there from here. Need to make a connection. Where's the swamp biome? Ah, I see a swamp tree. Okay, it was behind this mountain. That is a very odd float. It's not even a floating island. Interesting. Yeah, but there's a swamp biome over here. In the John Smith texture pack. We got one, two, a three. Beautiful. Or maybe that's a fourth one, too. Yeah, there's four. It's beautiful. Beautiful sheep. Boats break. Lily pads. And you can... They're not destroyed. They're harvested, so... If you go slow enough, you can actually collect them. I spy a witch's hut. Sun's going down. See if we can't get some slimes to spawn. There's no slime action so far. There's a slime. Here he comes, too. Uh, run, slimes, run. We'll just harvest up some uh, slime here and see ya. So we do have a slime in the boat, but I don't know how to kick it out besides to break the boat. I heard there is a button you can press. How do I get out of here? I'm lost. One of the best features about 1.9 boats is that they don't break which means you don't have to carry bunches and bunches of boats on you you know you just need the one boat and it's not gonna break but what we're gonna do next is attempt to break them see we could pick up baby slimes with our boat but not we couldn't pick up any 
any of the other creatures like maybe chickens because they're the same size or like baby zombies haven't tried those guys yet but we made it back here boat I was inside of it So that does not break the boat. Next, we'll try cactus, but we don't have any cactus, and I'm not sure where a desert is. So I think we just call it here for today. I'd like to say thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed yourself at any time, please go ahead and smash that like button. It really does help out a lot, and I do appreciate it very much. Until next time, guys, peace out.